Welcome back everybody to Elder Scrolls Online with Tamri and the Crafter. We are going to try and get to the Mages Guild without getting caught. Now so far I've managed to do most of this without without getting um without getting caught, but I I'm sure my luck is bound to run out. Uh looks like I've gone the wrong way too. Well, of course I did. I want to be over here. Okay, that's not too bad. We can do that. Just means we're going to double back a little bit. Okay, we're going to double back a lot. What I want to do is get across that building up there. I'm just not sure I can get up to the, the top. I think there was a guard around this corner last time I looked. Alrighty. So we're going to go up this way. Then we're going to cross this bridge. Then I want to veer to my left. Left? No, I want to veer to my right. Oh, we're not that lost. Excellent. We're just, you know, only a little bit lost. See, and someone made this nice bridge for us, which I'm so pleased to see. Except, of course, I keep getting lost on it. Like everywhere else. So we're just going to toddle around this way. And head on up the hill. And round. Alright, so the Mages Guild... I think is right here. Let me just see if there's a guard. Not anymore. I mean, like I said, you can fight your way through this entire scenario, or you can have a rather slow run like I've just done. And, um... Razin? Something I can help you with? I'm rather preoccupied. So make it quick. I, um, I need some of your specialty. I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm just a simple apothecary, friend. That's what Ufa said. The rogue. Sometimes I wish the Imperials did find him. <laughs> Here's your powder. It'll paralyze in a matter of moments after being ingested. Take care you don't breathe it in. Thank you, Razin. I'll, um, I'll leave now. All right. I think I need to... Oh no, the owl, isn't it? So there's the drowsy owl. That's where we've got to go next. Is there an upstairs door? Yes, look at that. Let's go this way. I know it says to go downstairs through the door. And when I first played the game, I didn't know it well enough to take alternatives. So um, now I am. Yeah, because that's where we want to be. Let's... Um, I, th I think those nice people murdered all the guards in this area, except for him. He's been unmurdered again. Where is that wow, I sure hope she's not talking about me. Where are we going? Drowsy Owl. I don't want to go that way. I actually want to turn back the way I come and run along the wall and then drop down. Alright, we got this. Yeah, now we're going in the right way. You can just drop down in increments so you don't hurt yourself a lot. And you know, you only want to hurt yourself a little bit. That's right, I forgot. That top door is bolted. Alrighty. This should be the drowsy owl. No, I think I just ran past it. Oh no, where is it? I came down too far. Alright, we are going to have to play chicken to get back up. Remember I come up here last time. 
There it is. And Neha's upstairs, which is why the mark is a little bit off. I tell lies, here she is. Have you got everything you need? Oh yes, right here. There's a bottle of wine in the alcove for you, though I've no idea what you'll do with it. I'll serve it to Maradem, and then you and Ufa can do what you must. But after that, I'll have no part in what comes. Understood, Nifa, Niha. The Ring of Daggers. You've heard the name whispered about and you know what it means. Corrupted officials, unexplained disappearances, murders in the night. The Ring of Daggers. Agents, infiltrators, provocateurs, merchants of death doing the dirty work for the bloody merchant king, Emmerich the Faithless. Here in your town, in your own neighborhood, probably even among people you trust and think you know. Wow, that's propaganda. My brother worked the shipyards at Tava's Blessing. Thanks to you, he can soon return. Please. I'm glad it's worked for you. Wait here. I brought you refreshments, sir. Niha! Always so good to me. Let's taste this fine concoction. A strange flavor. What kind of wine? Question Maradam. Who are you? What have you done with Niha? We don't what was know. in that wine? I'll ask the questions. Where's the Grandea? How dare you? Whoa. What's happening to me? D did you poison me? Please, give me an antidote. I'll tell you anything. Then answer my question. She's in front of the palace. I have the key for the stocks, but they guard her exceptionally well. They'll execute her within the week. That's all I know. Now please, give me the antidote. I'll give you the key. Very well. Bleating like a cut lamb, I see. Ufa, I thought you were dead. That was the intent. Get the key off his body and leave him. Man, we have to wash my hands after this. Thought I got the key already off the... All right. Well, Ufa, I guess I know what I need to do next. We'll go from the rooftop, I think, rather than... um. Rather than go down. Just, just until I can get a feel for where I need to be. Okay, so I need to go all the way back up that way. Uh, so if I can, I need to get back... No, that won't help me any. I'm, I'm either... No, no, if I can, I need to get back onto this and run around. And, um, and then cut, a, cut across. All right. Maybe there was a set of stairs somewhere up here? No, it does not look like it, but that's where I need to be. Oh, I know. All right, so we're back on the wall, and we're going to run all the way across to here. So let's go do that. Just ignore that nice man there. Yep, and then we had to get in through here. I haven't found a shortcut through here yet, so... All right, this is new. Watch where he's going. This might be a little too close. Ah, oh, man, they're so active, aren't they? Looks like my, my fellow adventurers have been this way. <laughs> and not long ago.
good. I'm free. Let the people know the time has come. Yes, Grandia. Light the two watchtowers. We must rise up against the Imperials. Yes, Grandia. We're not causing mischief. <laughs> I know, right? Let's go. Watchtower one's relatively easy, but lighting the next one could be difficult. Let's um, let's see if we can manage it. I'm just livid. Hey, hey! Got to admire that guard still doing his job when there's a mob forming. Either very brave, very loyal, or really dumb. Let's go. Yep. Talk to Ufa, the red asp. I know, I, last time I think I just ran straight down into that guy. Ufa. It's time. Where are the rest of your people? They ready themselves for battle. We will hold the palace while you take out the Imperial within. We must all move quickly. What about the Grandea? She's in no shape to fight. I can't imagine what torture she must have endured under the Imperial's reign. You are our symbol, friend. What? Our symbol of freedom. Very well, Ufa. I'll... Do my best to be a There's good no symbol. time to waste. We must strike now, for the Imperials will have time to make preparations. What do I do? Go inside and slay that Imperial Sadas Secundus like the dog she is. Very well. We don't know what kind of forces she has with her. We are counting on you. I won't let you down. I do wish it would automatically go to the next um thing in the sequence as in the next adventure that pops up rather than shifting to a, an adventure outside the region man it looks like someone else has had all the fun and stolen all the stuff <laughs> they did leave me books to read though that's kind of nice i'll take that by the eight someone stop that thief Hi. Oh, what? I've heard a lot about you. <laughs> Finally, we meet in person. I've come to reclaim Helen's stand from the Imperials. Old. I like that. It's unfortunate you've picked the wrong side. The Legion needs more soldiers with that kind of attitude. No matter. Holland's stand will be our stronghold in the Covenant, and no upstart shall challenge that. I disagree. Did you think I'd let anyone walk in here unchallenged? You are a fool, as are the rest of them. I'll enjoy watching you die. Now, now, you're not very nice, are you? Defeat the traitor Maradum and Sadus Secundus. Where are they? And I have a bounty on my head because I um, stole something I shouldn't have. Oh, that looks pretty good. Okay. I won't fail you again. Sure, don't fail her again. That's fine. I'll have some mushrooms though. This this tabard is really painful, and I probably should destroy it. There. See, you won't fail her again because you'll be dead. Won't surrender. Your life is forfeit. Defeat Sela Secundus. I would, but she's not. Wait, is she above? She is above. Let me find her. Okay, clearly it was his life that was forfeit and not mine. I'll make you an example to these dogs. 
now now that's not a very nice way to talk about your future people ah mushrooms I know, there go the beetles. You can tell it's a huge chunk of your points comes off when they hit. Good beetles. I like you very much. Alright. Um, I just need to, I don't know, hide in a corner for a while until my bounty goes away. <laughs> you saw me stealing this time. Well, okay, fine. Ooh. Does that count as a furnishing? Give me a minute. It is a furnish. I could <laughs> steal it and keep it. Oh, uh, yeah. I think I'm going to go get caught and uh, pay my fine and let them take all the stuff and give it back to their rightful owners. Um, rather than mess up the, <laughs> the story, I'm not under death penalty. I just have to pay money for being a little bit reprehensible. All right. A lot reprehensible. Leave Grandea Noara's palace. Speak to her as the thieving adventurer that I am. Don't trifle with me. Ufa. You've done it. The Seventh Legion will be our prey. Is Helen stand free? The Imperials had no chance. Good. We took them by storm. Without their leader, they had nowhere to turn. What few are left will fall easily. You were the linchpin for it all. I had your help. The Grand Air will have something to say too, no doubt. Here she comes now. Oh no, that lady scares me. And she should. Holland stand. We have won the day. A stranger to our city was the spark. Let us never forget this, or those who fell in the fight. Grandea. And here is the savior of my people, my city, and me. We are all in your debt, friend. What's next for Halland Stand? We must rebuild. The Imperials tore apart our fine city, but we will rise from the sands. You have given us this chance. Forever will Holland Stand remember your work and your sacrifices. Thank you, Grandea. <sighs> All right, so basically, you restored Grandea Noir to power in Halland Stand, and we unlocked the uh, the thing. What I'm just going to do now is check my map. Right, we've now completed all of the story quests, but we still haven't found one of the way shrines in the area, the Halcyon Lake Way Shrine. Um, we do have we do have a couple of more uh, caves to delve, and we do have a few quite a few more sites to unlock in this region. Um, and striking locales you'll notice it's ticked off in my in my achievement but it's not ticked off for my character and that's because this character hasn't found them all yet the viridian hideaway must be in the viridian woods i have to go find it and i need to find the apprentice um razak's wheel i'm not sure i'm game to do that one yet oh my gosh we have seven seven more sky shards and a ton more books, Shalador's library books. Because we've done the Mages uh, Guild quest line, we can actually see which books we need to get now. My goodness. Bankerai, shut that mage, never loan him a book. I must warn you, I'm in a foul mood. Uh, yep, anyone would be after being conquered for that long. So I'm guessing, um, I've got 69. Actually, let's see where the Thieves Guild is from here. We might be able to just duck in. It's, it's way over there. Oh, I don't know. Let's see if we can get to the Thieves Guild without being arrested. We might just offload our ill-gotten goods. I'm going to assume that that's a, a guard who's going to be a little cross with me. Yeah, all right, let's go this way. Oh, no. They now have they now have <laughs> people at the gate. Oh, uh, yeah. However, I wonder if this Thieves Highway will help. Oh yeah, let's go this way. Fair, don't do it. Fair Dinkum, you scare me when you do that.
Now, I'm not sure if the Hallands Liberators will arrest us. Um, and we did just restore order. Lucky us. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to blithely <laughs> run. Well, let's go around the back. Might be a good idea. Uh, except I don't think we can get all the way around. I reckon this is going to be a dead end. I don't know, how did I do it last time? I know, the, look, the, the Imperials have gone and I'm completely lost already. Oh wait, I can fit through here. I know, 46 is my fine. Alright, where's this Thieves Guild now? Run along the back of that. Past the stables and that that length of wall. Even the carpenter. So see, now I've unlocked the crafting in this section too. That's pretty good. I wonder if there'll be crafting rents here. I know, I'm, I'm lost. Give me a minute. Give me a minute to, um, that's not the Thieves Guild, that's a, you're a goose. Well, you know what, that answers that question though. There is no Thieves Guild. You know what I see out here? I see Howler's Nook. Sounds like a cozy kind of place, right? Actually, how full is my backpack? Let's go empty our backpack a bit. The magical ring. Wow. Enchanting table. Let's extract a bit of that. Let's sell to Salafa. Hail, friend. I heard shouting about Imperials invading or some such. Is that true? <laughs> I, well, I don't really get out much. <laughs> I've been busy, you see. Take a look at the fruits of my labor. The best enchantments in all of Bankerai. I have a few things you can add to that. Okay. Ooh. Except that's part of the Sword Singer set. Yeah, we'll sell that too. We'll sell the bread. Magicka, health, and stamina. War belt, tea. The Zinger Muzz tea. Uh, I'm not sure what my jewelry's at. Actually, I probably shouldn't have sold those. Never mind. I'm just like, the gauntlets, I'm pretty sure we're, we're up on those now. If we're not, I'll just, um, I'll go nuts. I might just make a bit of a profit this time around instead of deconstructing everything. Spriggan's thorns. Oh, no, wait. I know why I actually want to, um, to not do that. Do oh. Yeah. The reason I don't want to sell all of these is because I'm, if I'm going to add them to my collections, if I don't already have them, let's repair everything while we're here. Um, they won't, they won't bond if I, if I do that. All right, let's go for a bit of a wander. There may be things in my in my collections for the region that I haven't done yet. Am I still I've still got a bounty on my head. I forgot. Alrighty. Well let's head on down to the carpenters then. Where is he? I might run past him. I know, I, I, I could just go get caught. It it would be easier and simpler. I'm not seeing a lot of um Oh, 
I know. It'll be fine. 23. I'm really impatient. I won't get back out. Where's where's that? I think it was to the south, wasn't it? There's one up there. No, no, let's go this way. We might as well just go on power fine and head on out. Return all the stuff to the people we took it from. Um. Do -do. Oh, I'm now upstanding. It, it ran out, thank goodness. Alright, so as you can see in the top row there, I've got Ashaba's Oasis, Howler's Nook. Let's go get Howler's Nook. Maybe grab our, our Bambi. Sorry, our whatever it is. I thought um, there was an event on at the moment. It's only the 16th though. Oh, okay. There's an event coming. Ooh, an Imperial Researcher. Well, what do you want? Oh, okay. Probably to be alive again. A dead Imperial lies in the sand, his skin blistered as if struck by lightning. I will search the dead Imperial. Beneath the corpse lies a bundle of notes. Day seven. Damn dark in that cave. Under the sun I can see the construct show signs of dormancy rather than total failure. Day eight. No sign of additional inscriptions. I'll need to look elsewhere for clues as to how to open the vault in Razak's wheel. This construct must hold some clue. I should take it apart. There's a loud buzzing behind one of its compartments. I should investigate Razak's wheel and find out what the Imperials are doing. Hmm. Huh. That's me. I should. Mystery of Razak. Except I don't want to investigate Razak's wheel. Ooh. Up there, you reckon? How do I get up there? I see. I go this way. The reason I stopped here is there's usually these little camps, there's usually a book of some kind. And there we go. So basically, this is the myths of Shelgarath, and on the map, we are on our way to the site, or we're at the site, but I don't see it. The myths of Shelgarath, volume one. So here we are. What site is this? This is Howler's Nook. What's up there? Now I'm curious. You know what curiosity does though, right? It kills the cat and stuff. Huh. What's this? I know, I might have played it before, but I haven't. Ah, oh, this is the Sword Singer's Redoubt. This is the building. I think I own this one. This is the building that was um, that was given to us. So we own this because um, in the not the giveaways in the um, all of this all of this is the oh my gosh okay. So because in the daily rewards, I think for April or May, they, um, this was one of the rewards. Oh my, I didn't realize it was so big. It, like in the picture, it just looked like a bunch of little tents. A week. <laughs> oh, whoa. Well, decorating this place is going to be fun, isn't it? So, um, yeah, so this was part of the 10th anniversary um, Hearth and Home, part of the Hearth and Home celebration. You are kidding me. This place is huge. I'm not sure that if there are evil fish in here, though. It would be a horrible house if you died in it because you got eaten by um, fish, wouldn't it? Well, I guess we'll find out. I mean, 
mean, they'd make a great defense for your home, sure, but... Okay, we can go around this way. I, I know. <laughs> so I picked it up as part of my rewards, and I've never actually had a look at it. This place is amazing. If you guys have, have um, picked this up in your daily rewards, the Sword Singer's Redoubt, um, go for a bit of a run through it. It's huge. Like it's got that big cavern underneath. But maybe, yep, there's your entry. No, there's your entry. Okay, wait a minute. So this is more inside here. So here it is. Here, this is what they showed you. Just the just the tent in the middle. Wow! But they didn't show you everything underneath it. I I can barely get my head around it. Actually, I'm just trying to work out what I would do with all of this space. We could put our our mounts and everything in here. So we come down here already. I think. I know, give me a minute while I explore the new treasure. No, we haven't come down here already. Alright, so there's this massive room here we can put things in. Howler's Nook. I, I know Bear, but it's their home too. Oh, whoa. Okay, here are where the rooms are. I don't know, I think I'd probably have to have I don't know, some way of guiding myself through because I reckon I'll get incredibly lost in here. Okay, so we come across here, right? Maybe. We can go downstairs. We can just come out of there. So let's go downstairs see what's in here. Sure, we came down here. So you get this big open platform. We could probably put tapestries and things up in here. All oh, right. Okay. And then I came down here and worried about fish. Probably with good reason. I I should not be swimming in the drinking water, to be honest. This would be such a cool, um, like, retreat from the desert, too. It would be lovely. Okay, so I can come down the back way, radio. And I'm not very comfortable with water. In Australia, they, we, we, we all learn to swim at school. Or we're all supposed to learn to swim at school, and I did. I just don't like it. <laughs> alright, so I think I came out this way last time. Yeah, and then, alright, so we can come this way. So this must be the way, the way that I came down before. Wow. So that was an amazing um, gift for for our for our daily rewards. Let's leave the home now, though. We're going to go and find. We've unlocked Howler's Nook by the look of it. Found ourselves a mage book, another one, which is always handy. <sighs> and now I'm heading on out this way. I know, Rubido hide node. You think those beetles could actually help us? Just mine, don't you? I, I, what I really want to do before I finish off exploring all the Bankrai is, is I actually want to go and finish the um, the main storyline for the game, which is um, 
where you lose your soul in Soul Harbor. I think we've done part of that. But, um... All right, let's go find Razak's wheel. They're, they're teleporting out, so they definitely don't want this. Good. All right. Let me just make sure I've got the mission up. So we're up in Bankarai. The Mystery of Razak. This is a public dungeon. Those aren't your friends. I think it's P for group activities, into endeavors, kill a world boss, excavate two antiquities. Oh, we've got to do that too. Refine raw materials five times. It's dual. So we could go and do our antiquities for our daily quests. Afflict 150 enemies with weapon poisons over the week. Um. Yes, I have poisons loaded. Radio. Rude. These guys are just such eager beavers. Okay, it's a necromancer. I'm not sad anymore. Slap it, bear. Beautiful. Nice job, bear. I don't think we're going to find a lot of treasure today. There seems to be a lot of adventurers around today. Let's head into Rezak's wheel. And uh, we'll see what we can find. So this is the public dungeon, Razak's wheel. Ah, <laughs> oh, I'm not sure I can survive it actually. I, even even at this level, we'll see. Level 50, and I've got. I should be able to survive it. I'm just not sure I'm good enough. All right, there's normally someone up here, so clearly that adventurer has been through here. Let's run the adventure. Here we go. Do that. Not using the seat. Go for the oh blueprint. Love my blueprints. I don't care if they're green. I like them when they're purple, but hey, green is good. We don't have all the skills for the purples. Mermaid whiskey. Gonna have to brew a little bit of that. Let's um Oh! Right, three and one and two and beetles Aid me. and brutality. More beetles. I love these beetles. They're very good. I oh, know. That's why they're very good. Ah, oh, lovely. We made a mess. We'll clean it up now. There's books over here. You never know what you might find. Now kill. Don't kill, and don't roast. Alright, fine. You just made it worth my while to put the beetles, to let the beetles loose. You, leave my bear alone. I know. We're, we're still going to clean up the Dwemer pots, even if all that's left in them is lockpicks. Um, just simply because, you know, treasure will improve next time round. Probably not for me, but anyway. <laughs> it's an exercise in being tidy. I'm a plague and pestilence all by myself, I think. Discomforts of war. Is that another adventurer? Hi, adventurer. I know, I'm doing, um, be good to do it together, but if they don't want to wait, that's fine too. Oh, 
Okay, we can do this. You there, a little bit of help would be appreciated. Okay. I don't believe it. Thank the sense. Who are you? Uh, how about untying me? They've had me down here for a week. What are you doing down here? Name's Damarina. I'm a Covenant scout. I saw the Imperial tents on my patrol and came to investigate. Ended up getting captured. Right, because that wasn't obvious. I'll free you. I think they just killed one of my bosses. Oh. That's okay, I'm busy talking, so that's fine. Tall Papa and I owe you one, my new friend. But I need to ask another favor, if I can. What do you need me to do? I was carrying orders when they captured me. Mm -hmm. Should have been more careful. But we've never seen Imperial activity this deep in the desert. I didn't even have time to destroy the orders. They've got everything I was carrying. What's in the orders? They contained every patrol route the Covenant uses in the area. We need to make sure we recover those orders and eliminate everyone who's seen them. Luckily, I know exactly who to hit, if you're willing. Who do you want me to kill? You'll want to find Major Karina and Spymaster Gaeta. Okay. They interrogated me. And they're the only ones high-ranking enough to bother reading the orders. So eliminate them and recover my orders. And then we maybe can get out of here. I'll take care of the Imperials. Where can I find them? Major Karina was covered in grease. She's likely digging through the guts of a Dwemer construct somewhere. Okay. As for Spymaster Gaeta, I never met a spy who wasn't obsessed with high ground. She'll be at the highest elevation she can find. I'll find them. I'm going to find a place to lay low. Tell Papa, watch over us both. Notes on Razak was brilliant. And they couldn't get into the vault. They've searched it. Still we're close. One door stands between us and the army that never stops. Alrighty. I'll just go for the materials these guys have left behind. Because they don't want them, so that's good. So we're not in competition. Happy with that. I like the water skins. We, Like I said, we do potions, so might as well keep a good stock of them. Not that they're not easy to come by, but I just feel better if, I, if I'm thorough. Alrighty. Pretty sure there's meant to be a boss in this area. Burn it! Don't burn it. That's unfriendly. Hehe. <laughs> I know, right? Alrighty. We'll have to come back this way. Like I said, I'm pretty sure there's a boss I've missed. Uh, wait a minute. Find the Mundus key. Where's my map? Alright. Let's go back this way. A lot of people too like to farm the dungeons so they can sell stuff. Like they'll sell the, the stuff they find in there. Good bear. I should probably apply some of these points I've been getting to. Didn't I come through here before? No, I didn't. Imperial necromancers. I hate these guys. Radio. Search the anvil. Found the Mundus key. That's got to be good. Let's see if there's um, anything else in this little area, just in case they've tucked a chest up behind something. I mean, they may have done, I might have missed it. There might have been, like I said, there's a lot of adventurers today. So it's always worth checking. Not today, there's not. Let's have a look. Let's see where my next. Ooh, that looks like my person with the orders, and there's something else in there I need to have as well. Rightio, let's go. Let's go get the orders first. 
Looks like fun, right? Oh no, this is a tough fight. I think I made a mistake. Oh no! I'm sorry! Hit it there. Ow! Smack in the head. There, slap it again. Oh, you can't yet? Okay. Now slap it. Back of the head there, get it. Spy Master Gator. You okay there? You look a little bit slowed there, mate. Ooh, I wonder what's up the top here. I've never actually run around the outside. And yet this game they love. They love hiding things on sh on ledges. You know what? I think someone's mad at me. Oh wow, there's a few someone's mad at me. <laughs> I don't think they're going to give up either. Let's um let's get them. Don't set it ablaze. It does not want to be set ablaze. What? There's another mage throwing fireballs at me over here. Good bear. I know. They're a little bit stirred up, aren't they? Just a tad. Hey look, there's there's another four we could annoy. Can't be too careful. <laughs> no, you cannot. I love the way they're lined up. Oh no, no, don't light it up, you evil peen. Take you out. Take you out and not for dinner. Take you out. Don't hit me in the back of the head, that's just rude. There, slap that thing, will you? Alright, failing that, slap this one. Fireball me, I'll bird you, we'll all be even in the long run. That was so much fun. <laughs> you have a very strange idea of fun, my friend. These normally have good crafting materials in. Oh, okay, in that case, we got some bits and bobs. Cool and pa. Radio. My adventuring friends have been here. The empty, the empty thing with just the lockpicks. That's an I was here with love from adventurers. I need to go over there. Let's stir these guys up. They look like they need a little bit of fun. Oh, no bear! Come back! I know. I accidentally sent him away. I hit the um, tab. Slap it, bear. Beautiful job there. Alrighty. This is definitely a tough little dungeon. But it's doable. At this level it's doable on your own, which is nice because you get to solo it, you don't have to rely on your friends being around or able to play when you are. I do like that. The um the group dungeons not so much, they're a little bit harder. Find the orary. The Aetheris key. Trade Close with the uh, necromancer. Slap that necromancer there. Very good. Such a lovely four four. Got a good left swing on him, that bear. Oh my gosh. Well, let me just see. I know. Could go this way. Looks to me like there's um. There's a sky shard in here. We should probably get. An Imperial healer. Man, you are not doing much healing right now. And uh, my job is to make sure you don't do it again. Good bear. I'm sorry bear. Do you want some help? I've got some beetles and you can slap that thing now. Very good bear. Such a good job. Ooh, that XP, man. Ooh. 
Ooh, that looks unfriendly. Let's irritate it. A dwarven gear. Is that all it could give me? <laughs> it's down there. Oh, probably not somewhere I want to jump down, right? got those things in behind it. Where's my bear? Bear? Slap it. I don't know, I'm not quite sure what I was thinking there. My, there you are, bear. Are you slacking off over there? And for map. All right, we'll take the, uh, the fountain. Splish around in that for a bit, so we can come up with the Orbis key. Adamantite's always good. Ginkgo twist tonic. You know what? I don't actually think I've got. Ooh. I didn't even see that sitting back there. That is such a good, such a good find. Did not register it as something I could search. I'm going to have to keep an eye out for them now. All right. Uh, all right, I have to go down this way anyway. So what we're going to do is we're going to detour into that sky shard before we go. I love the way these adventures are like, nah, I should be right. Yeah, thanks guys. I'm fine. Would you like a hand, however? No, you're good. Radio. I think they've spent a lot of time just running from stuff. Where's my map? Grab that. Check my map. Yeah, we do want to go this way. Have that. Which means if they've been running from things, they haven't been doing a lot of looting, although they are not the only adventurers in here. Yay! Crafting motive, Twemma belts! Yeah, so happy to see it. I wonder if I'm a high enough level to learn it. I guess we'll find out. Oh, let's use that. Meddling Imperials, disrupt the wheel. Okay, we're here on the map. You can probably get to it more easily if you run around. There, I was wondering if that was a thing I should worry about. Boom. <gasps> I got two! That's so good! All right, I am going to have to stop and learn some of these um these recipes. Let me just while I'm in this corner into our eye for inventory, and I'm just going to go. We'll isolate it down to recipes. I know that one. Oh, nice! All right, well we got some of those. Let's um go over to miscellaneous. Donald Page. I'm pretty sure I know these two. Yeah, three. Yeah, we got those. Crown items. No. Uh, style motives. <gasps> yes, yeah, so new. I'm so pleased. All right. I know nothing like supplies in the woodwork. Oh, this is a boss. Oh, my bad. Ah! 
Slap it, bear. Slap it, bear. Very good, bear. Now you're getting it. Let's beetle that thing. Let's have some healing. Let's uh, augment some of that healing. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> What? Oh man, he murdered my bear. I'm so sorry, bear. I did not watch you well enough. Clearly, other adventurers have been here. <laughs> I try to search the boss. Ooh, look at that. Nice. Alright. So good. We just took out the boss. That's a dwarven centurion. Let's go get it. Slap it there. Mushrooms. Brutality. Bird. And fire. I'll take the big brute out, then we're gonna switch targets to the little brute over here. See, this is what I thought the other guy was. Just this little ordinary sphere that was an easy kill. Oh, my bad. Oh, that looks like the big boss over in the corner. We can take him. Okay, my other character can take him at this level. I'm not sure if I can take him. Let's find out the hard way. Where am I meant to be going? Oh, yeah, that way. That's fine. Backstab a little machine. You're not supposed to know tricks like that. Thank you for that. Now, let me do my part. There, you keep the big monster busy. Now that she's not going to destroy us anymore, let's deal with the flesh abomination. I know, this is the difference that a bit of food makes. You can take on a lot more than you would otherwise. And granted, while the, a lot of the stuff is achievement, unlocked, Razak's wheel, group event, Yes, we did it. Even if there wasn't a group to do it with, we did it. So, okay, we've taken out the two bosses in this room. I should probably have some direction as to how this... So what I want to do now is I want to build up um, plenty of XP to... Um, just get my champion points, like get a ton of champion points. Okay, and uh, and just fill those, and because I really want to see what it's like to play a character with that many champion points, that'd be a lot of fun. So there we go. So that's that bit done. Alright, where am I meant to be going? I could pick on monsters all day, but... Did it see me? It saw me. Okay, that's the evil dude. I'm actually just trying to find out where I've got to go. And I, and I am lost. Oh look. Fine, you could have lived. Now I'm going to reduce you to scrap. Very good. 
I don't think these nice people are going to let me out of here. Oh, whoops, I've gone past the entrance. Well, they're never going to let me out if I go past the entrance. Let me just go over here. There we go. Three. Bear slap. Take out the trash. That's useful. Bear slap. Listen, stop welding me. I'm not metal. I know, we're gonna get both of them because that's the way they operate. I'm not sure if the bear needs healing or not, so I'm just going to put some mushrooms out there. Beautiful. Come on, bear. Looks like I've been here through before. Actually, I think this is where I found all those really nice recipes. Very good, bear. Oh, okay, this is another uh, boss from the Dill, so let's just go. Out of five, out of four, and mushrooms, and beetles, and birds. There we go. Bear gets mushrooms too. Slap it there. Beautiful. We need both these four mushrooms. Oh, I'll have that. I don't know if I can get through it before that thing comes back, but hey. Now I know to look for these chests. Yes. Alrighty, let's go. Heading on down, grab that Rubidite ore. It is like it's a public dungeon. It is one it is one massive hack fest because you're just always fighting. And and in my case I'm not actually trying to avoid them this time. Oh, where did all these come from? Oh no, now I'm in trouble. Cute. Oops. <laughs> let's let's go here. I know I was not watching myself very well at all. We can just jog past it, like in ghost form. I'm looking for chests. It's going to be the death of me, but I'm also looking for a quiet space to summon my bear. Which is what got me killed, because I got rid of him by accident. <laughs> Derpy buttoning. Alright. Notes on the door. On the vault door. Dwemer jug. And Dwemer pot. Ooh, Orcish banner. I think I actually know that one, though. So let me just check. Over to here. Oh, I didn't know that one. Well, okay then. Uh, <laughs> hang on a minute. I should probably read them. The door to Ruzik's vault is one of the most impressive feats of Dwemer engineering I've seen. It resists every unlock spell I know and shrugs off even the strongest destruction spells. Perhaps the most fascinating part of the door is the series of pictograms etched into the door itself. They seem to form a narrative, and if my admittedly limited knowledge of language serves me, it's the classic elven cosmogony. First there was Orbus, the formless chaos from which uh, the universe was formed. 
Then Lorcan convinced the Aedra to sacrifice themselves to create the world, Mundus. Then finally, at the birth of the world, Magnus opened a hole to Aetherius, creating the sun and letting magic flow into Nern. This trinary comes up frequently in Razak texts, chaos, earth, and magic. Perhaps it's central to its understanding of creation, not just of the world, but of constructs as well. I'll have to ruminate on this later. For now, I'll try my hand at picking the lock. Perhaps I'll have success with mundane, where magic failed. All right. So, first there was Orbus. Then there was Mundus. Then there was Aetherius. Let's go. So, in these dungeons, it's actually really, really useful to read the texts you're given. Okay? They just help an awful lot. Now, where's my bear? There he is. What a good bear. So Dwarven Gears, they don't sell for much, but you get so many of them that they make a little tiny bit of money. Oh dear. And I just, you know, can't help myself. I have to dig it up. I can't have that. I can have... Oh, I have this. Cantaloupe bread. You know, I don't think I've got that. Dwemer Journal. The journal is written in the fierce strokes of the Dwemer language. The text contains Dwemer writing and alchemical symbols. A detailed diagram of a Dwemer machine accompanies the text. The device needs a final cog to be fully functional, and the diagram shows a design for the cog model. Hmm, let's study that diagram. The diagram includes a map of Razak's wheel and seems to indicate that if you can find the cog mold, you could create a cog using nearby machinery. The cog can then be used to complete Razak's machine in a chamber further south. Well, guys, on that note, that intriguing little note, I'm going to bid you goodbye. If you enjoyed the episode please hit like if you want to see more please hit subscribe and we're gonna get moving the next episode take care out there